Welcome to Linux Help Tutorial. I am going to explain about how to install CMS Made Simple in Ubuntu. CMS Made Simple is an open source content management system which is based on PHP and MySQL. Using the CMS Made Simple, you can create your own professional website and manage your contents without having any experience level. For installing the CMS Made Simple, you need to have the LAMP server installed in your system. After installing the LAMP server, you can continue installing the CMS Made Simple. Now we can see the installation of CMS Made Simple in Ubuntu. First, we can download the installation package using the wget command. wget. Now the download link. Now give enter. Now the package is getting downloaded. This will take some time. Now the file is downloaded. Next we can create the CMS made simple directory in the document root directory. Make directory slash var www.html slash cms iphone made simple. Now give enter. Now the directory is created. Now we can extract the downloaded package to the newly created directory. Tar iPhone XVF the package name space iPhone C space the newly created directory slash now give enter. Now the files are extracted to the newly created directory. Next, we can create the MySQL database for the CMS made simple. Now we can log in into the MySQL server MySQL iPhone U root iPhone P. Now we can create the database create database space CMS MSTP. Now the database is created. Now we can create the database user and set password for the user and also grant privileges for the database. Grant all privileges on space the database name dot asterisk to the database user at localhost identified by the database user password with grant option now give enter next flush the privileges flush privileges now exit next we can create the new virtual host directive in, Ap in apache we can create the new Apache configuration file that is cms ms.conf nano slash etc apache2 sites available cms ms.conf now we need to add the following virtual host configuration to the configuration file in the server name we need to add your domain name now save the file and exit. Now we need to create the soft link for the configuration file ln s slash etc apache2 sites available slash cms cms dot conf space slash etc apache2 sites enabled space slash cms cms dot conf now the link is created next we need to edit the php dot ini file nano slash etc php file slash apache2 slash php dot ini now search for the maximum execution time press ctrl plus w and search max 
execution time the maximum execution time can be changed to 120 and next you need to search for the upload maximum size upload max underscore file size and you can change your maximum upload size I am going to change it to 10 MB uh, next you need to change the post max size post max underscore size now change it to 10 MB and now save the file and exit now we need to restart the Apache web server service Apache to restart now the Apache web server is restarted here you can see the ownership for the CMS made simple is root root now we need to change the ownership for the CMS made simple directory change own hyphen r www hyphen data colon www hyphen data space CMS made simple and give enter now the ownership is changed for the directory now open the web browser now enter your IP address slash cms iphone made iphone simple give enter now you can see the installation page of cms made simple now select your language and now give submit now give continue here you can see the permissions on the php settings are checked and you can continue and you can give your file creation mask and give continue and we need to give the admin account information username for the admin and the email address for the admin the password and give continue you can give the site name and select your time zone now enter your database information and select your database type and the database name that is cms ms db the database username cms ms user the password for the database user ok continue and now we can see the tables are created now you can see the installation is completed now give continue and here you can see the link to go to the admin panel now select the link and here you can see the admin panel is opened and here's the main page of the admin panel and here you can view your site this is the default contents in the site and using this dashboard you can make changes to your site here's the layout option and here you can add your extensions and here's the preferences the cms made simple is successfully installed in ubuntu thank you for watching